Hi, my name is John Kennison and I'm the Chief Investment Officer at Baker Boyer. As we ring in the new year, following a 2022 that saw a surge in inflation, it saw a Russian invasion of Ukraine, and it saw aggressive monetary policy tightening by central banks around the world. As a result, we saw balanced stock and bond portfolios down more than we've seen since 2008. Both stock and bonds were simultaneously down, um, and that's something that's actually fairly rare. As we ring in the new year, Financial news will continue to be dominated by the Fed and the potential rate hikes and any potential economic weakness that may cause. There'll be a lot of talk of potential recession. And it's really important as we hear all of that talk that can be somewhat unnerving to remember three key things. The first thing is remember that stocks are forward looking or that is stock markets are forward looking. They're, all, they're constantly thinking about what's going to happen in the next year. What are the potential economic, what will the economic environment be like? Will there be a recession? Will we see continued inflation? All of those kinds of things. And they're pricing those things in today. So much of the price decline that we saw in 2022 may well already reflect much of the economic weakness that people expect in 2023. The second thing to remember is that during recessions, Stocks tend to begin going up long before a recession has ended. In fact, on average, if we look at the last nine recessions going back to 1960, we see that stocks on average go up about six months before unemployment has peaked. For that reason, it's really important to remember, don't try to time the market. The third thing that I want everyone to, to take to heart is it's really important to have a financial plan, not just because you have a financial plan, answer questions about you know, education funding or retirement funding, but it helps build investment portfolios that are tailored to you and can withstand almost any market environment, whether there's inflation or deflation, expansion or contraction, regardless of the monetary policy environment. So I encourage you all, build a financial plan, build an investment plan that is appropriate to your financial plan, and it'll help you be more disciplined in the coming year. Attached to this video, you'll find more detailed analysis of the market and the economy, and I encourage you all to re uh, read it. And if you have any questions about this video or anything you read in the attached article, I encourage you to reach out to a member of your team. If you don't currently work with Baker Boyer, you can find us at bakerboyer.com. We'd be happy to answer any questions that you have. Thank you all. Have a great 2023 and take care.